This year's El Nino expected to be the worst ever recorded. The World Meteorological Organization says this year's El Nino is growing stronger and is expected to become the worst ever recorded. Conditions are ripe for the most powerful El Nino ever recorded as sea surface temperatures in the Pacific Ocean are as much as 2 degrees Celsius above average. Weakened winds that usually blow warm water in the eastern Pacific to Indonesia and Australia, as well as the unusually warm atmosphere that characterizes El Nino, will shift a subtropical jet stream towards California and the southern United States. As a consequence, El Nino is expected to bring a severe winter to the entire continental U.S. and bitter cold weather and heavy rain to the southern U.S. The Pacific Northwest, on the other hand, will be hit by a warmer and drier winter, aggravating the already problematic drought in the region. El Nino usually reaches maximum strength between October and January, but persists until May before reaching neutral conditions. At a global level, more frequent heat waves and the rising of sea levels will bring more flooding and tsunamis. Severe storms equivalent to Category 4 and 5 hurricanes will also occur more often. El Nino is often followed by La Nina, a separate weather pattern that is also becoming more extreme due to global warming. La Nina usually causes opposite effects to the ones associated with El Nino. It can cause drought in the southern U.S. and flooding in areas that were dried up by El Nino. Like this video? Don't forget to subscribe and follow us on Facebook, Google Plus, and Twitter.